हॅलो एव्हरी वन माय सेल्फ मिसेस मयुरी कंगळे असिस्टंट प्रोफेसर ऑफ मॅथमॅटिक्स फ्रॉम द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ ह्युमॅनिटीज अँड सायन्सेस वालचंद इन्स्टिट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नॉलॉजी सोलापूर टुडे वी आर गोईंग टू सी पार्शल डिफरन्सिएशन द लर्निंग आउटकम इज ॲट द एंड ऑफ दिस सेशन द स्टुडंट्स विल बी एबल टू सॉल्व द एक्झाम्पल्स ऑन पार्शल डिफरन्सिएशन इन प्रिवियस व्हिडिओ वी हॅव सीन द partial differentiation of first order now in this video we will see the partial differentiation of higher order the partial derivatives of higher order if they exist can be obtained from the partial derivatives of first order by differentiating them again since first order partial derivatives do z by do x and do z by do y themselves are the functions of x and y they can be further differentiated partially with respect to x as well as y these are called the second order partial derivatives of z now let us see the notations for the second order partial derivatives let f of x y be given function such that do f by do x and do f by do y that is the first order partial derivatives exist then differentiating do f by do x with respect to x partially that is do by do x of do f by do x is do to f by do x square or f to the suffix is xx similarly do f by do y when differentiated partially with respect to x we get do to f by do x do y which is also denoted as f to the suffix xy now if do f by do x is differentiated partially with respect to y we get do to f by do y do x that is f to the suffix yx and do f by do y when differentiated partially with respect to y we get do to f by do y square f to the suffix is yy in general f of x y be a function of two independent variables x and y when the function f of x y is differentiated partially with respect to x we get do f by do x and when this function is differentiated partially with respect to y we get do f by do y these two derivatives are called as the first order partial derivatives now when do f by do x is differentiated partially with respect to x we get do to f by do x square and when do f by do x is differentiated partially with respect to y we get do to f by do y do x similarly when do f by do y is differentiated partially with respect to x we get do to f by do x do y and when do f by do y is differentiated partially with respect to y we get do to f by do y square these four derivatives are called as the second order partial derivatives and out of these four second order partial derivatives the partial derivatives do to f by do y do x and do to f by do x do y are called as the mixed partial derivatives this point is written in this note note that in general these two mixed partial derivatives are same now we will see the order of differentiation in all the cases of higher order differentiation we differentiate moving along the denominator from right to left see here f to the suffix is xx or do to f by do x square we have to move from right that is here the first differentiation will be with respect to x then again with respect to x similarly when we have to find out f to the suffix xy or do to f by do x do y we have to again move from right to left in the right we have do y so the first differentiation will be with respect to y and then with respect to x similarly for do to f by do y do x the first differentiation will be with respect to x and then with respect to y and in the do to f by do y square first differentiation is with respect to y and then again with respect to y so to decide the order of differentiation we have to move along the denominator from right to left 
now let us see the standard rules if u and v are functions of x and y possessing partial derivatives of first order then just like the ordinary differentiation the rules of addition subtraction multiplication and division of ordinary derivatives holds good for the partial derivatives also now pause the video for a minute and write the answer of this question find first order partial derivatives of f of xy equals to x square plus sin y cube i hope you all have written the solution let us check the solution given that f of xy is equals to x square plus sin y cube now differentiating this f partially with respect to x treating y as constant gives us do f by do x is equals to the derivative of x square is 2x and as y is treated as constant the derivative of this term will be 0 so we get do f by do x equals to 2x now we will differentiate f partially with respect to y gives us do f by do y the derivative of x square will be 0 as x is treated as constant so we get do f by do y by differentiating sin y cube so we get do f by do y as 3 y square cos y cube now let us go for the examples first example find all the second order partial derivatives of f of xy equals to cos 2x minus x square e raised to 5y plus 3y square first we find the first order partial derivatives that is do f by do x and do f by do y so we will differentiate this f partially with respect to x as well as partially with respect to y so we get do f by do x equals to the derivative of cos 2x is minus sin 2x into 2 now e raised to 5y is treated as constant so e raised to 5y as it is and the derivative of x square is 2x so minus 2x e raised to 5y plus 3y square is there so it is treated as constant and its derivative is 0 so we get do f by do x as minus 2 sin 2x minus 2x e raised to 5y we will call it as equation number 1 now do f by do y is obtained by differentiating partially with respect to y treating x as constant so the derivative of cos 2x will be 0 now minus x square e raised to 5y is there and the x square is treated as constant so minus x square as it is and the derivative of e raised to 5y is e raised to 5y into 5 plus the derivative of 3y square is 6y so we get do f by do y as minus 5x square e raised to 5y plus 6y we will call it as equation number 2 now differentiating equation 1 with respect to x partially treating y as constant gives us do to f by do x square so do by do x of do f by do x now we will substitute do f by do x using equation 1 so we will write it as do by do x of minus 2 sin 2x minus 2x e raised to 5y the differentiation is with respect to x treating y as constant so f xx is equals to minus 2 as it is the derivative of sin 2x is cos 2x into 2 minus sin as it is e raised to 5y into 2 is a constant so 2 e raised to 5y as it is and the derivative of x is 1 so we get f xx as minus 4 cos 2x minus 2 e raised to 5y similarly differentiating equation number 2 with respect to y partially treating x as constant it gives us do to f by do y square so to obtain do to f by do y square we will differentiate do f by do y partially with respect to y so do by do y of minus 5 x square e raised to 5y plus 6y the differentiation is with respect to y treating x as constant so for the first term minus 5 x square will be treated as constant so in fyy minus 5x square as it is and the derivative of e raised to 5y is e raised to 5y into 5 plus the derivative of 6y is 6 so we get fyy as 
माइनस ट्वेंटी फाइव एक्स स्क्वायर ई रेस टू फाइव वाई प्लस सिक्स सिमिलरली डिफ्रेंशिएटिंग इक्वेशन वन विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू वाई पार्शली ट्रीटिंग एक्स एज कॉन्स्टेंट विच गिव दिस डो टू एफ बाय डो वाई डो एक्स दैट इज डो एफ बाय डो एक्स इज डिफ्रेंशिएटेड पार्शली विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू वाई नाउ फॉर दिस वी विल सब्सटीट्यूट डो एफ बाय डो एक्स सो वी गेट डो बाय डो वाई ऑफ माइनस टू साइन टू एक्स माइनस टू एक्स ई रेस टू फाइव वाई द डिफ्रेंसिएशन इज विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू वाई ट्रीटिंग एक्स एज कॉन्स्टेंट सो माइनस टू साइन टू एक्स विल बी अ कॉन्स्टेंट टर्म एंड इट्स डेरीवेटिव विल बी जीरो फॉर द सेकेंड टर्म माइनस टू एक्स विल बी ट्रीटेड एज कॉन्स्टेंट सो इट विल बी केप्ट एज इट इज एंड द डेरीवेटिव ऑफ ई रेस टू फाइव वाई इज e raised to 5y into 5 which gives us fyx equals to minus 10x e raised to 5y and differentiating equation 2 with respect to x partially treating y as constant which gives us do to f by do x do y that is do f by do y is differentiated partially with respect to x so substituting do f by do y gives us the equation do by do x of minus 5 x square e raised to 5y plus 6y now the differentiation is with respect to x treating y as constant so minus 5 e raised to 5y will be constant and the derivative of x square will be 2x so we get f x y equals to minus 10 x e raised to 5y and the derivative of 6y will be 0 as y is treated as constant so we get fxy equals to minus 10x e raised to 5y if you observe this fyx is minus 10x e raised to 5y and fxy is also minus 10x e raised to 5y which illustrate that the mixed partial derivatives are same thank you